Hei kaikki maailman ihmiset! Hi guys again, because that's what I've been saying today for you all. I'm here with the lovely Luna and we are going to talk about her products. So um, just going to hand over and let you guys take in all the information. <laughs> what is your brand? Well, I'm from Soften. Yeah. And uh, we, we have a factory in Turku, Finland. And we make uh, acoustic panels and partitions. Yeah. And this is our new product, this acoustic lamp. How does that work? You mean all our products? So. Um, specifically the acoustic the lamp? Yeah. Yeah, well, actually, we have this is uh, like polyester felt, the material, so it's actually like recycled bottles. And uh, it softens the noise and the echoes. Mm -hmm. And what, who, or like, who, or what other people do you work with? With, like, obviously. This is something that is necessary in this world, especially with like artists and um, musicians, DJs. Who have you worked with or who are you, do you, would you like to work with? Yeah, well actually we sell to, to homes and of course official places like banks and, and staff. And we do also radio stations, music rooms, movie rooms, etc. So there's a slideshow over there where you can see how our products are used and what they look like. We have different kind of shapes and colors. So awesome. really nice product. Yeah. So um, in the next five years, where would you like your products to be? Everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually, well, Acoustic is part of like well-being. It actually affects your um, ability to work okay. and to concentrate. So I would like to see that all schools and kindergartens, uh, workplaces would be acoustically nice. Awesome. Yeah. Cool. So thank you very much for doing this thank interview you. with me. Um, as always, guys, the links will be down below in the description for you to check out. Go check them out if you need anything to soften some sound in your house and to make things feel lovely and sound lovely. Make sure you go and check out Soften. Thank, Thank you. you. So I'm here with the lovely Elena. Hi. Um, so we're gonna have again have, just have a really cool chat um, about her products, which are behind me. They look really comfortable, but you will see it in just a few minutes. So bear with guys now. What is your business and your brand? Uh, we are Love One Tangori. Lapua's Beavers. We are located in Lapua, western part of Finland, and we have their uh, small weaving mill. We produce wool and linen textiles there. Oh, um, so, here are there blankets? Is it um, blankets or pillowcases or things like that? Yeah, yeah, we do. We have a uh, kitchenware, mostly made of linen, and then uh, sauna and spa things. Yeah, <laughs> bath towels. And then of course uh, the homeware, throws, hot water bottles, cushion covers, etc. Wait, hot water? Is it like the covers that go on the hot? Yeah, we do. Ooh. Here's one of them. Oh, that looks so cool. I like that. They're very nice. Made of 100% uh, cooked uh, wool. Okay. Weaved in Finland. Awesome. So, um, I'm going to put you on the spot here just a little bit. Out of all of these products, which one would be your favourite? Uh, I know, I'm sorry. I want to have all of them. <laughs> That's the problem in my job. Uh, I have to say, maybe the Corona Pro down there. We have several very beautiful colors. That's a good one. Also, Herbert Towel. This is gorgeous. This is our innovation of uh, linen and pencil mixed. It's very absurd, very. Uh, uh, it dries past, it's light, it's very too, um, easy to take uh, with you when you're traveling, etc. So, um, where do you see your company going in the next five years? We are now in international market and we are going for forward. Uh, our, um, we 
about to Japan and also the middle Europe but we are going wider yes okay. yeah. I'm glad. Um, having getting more innovations and new new uh, materials new designs okay. well um, guys make sure you go and check them out the website should be on screen right now and also in the link down below make sure you go click on it and check them out and basically you can get like a warm and cozy because it just looks all warm and cozy and lovely especially yeah. that hot water yeah. bottle it's all wellness <laughs> yeah. so yes thank you so much for doing thank this thank you with me. it's nice to meet you hi guys i'm here with the lovely larissa and we're going to look through some of the products that she bought today and find out what they are and how comfortable they are what do i mean by that who knows <laughs> What is the name of your brand? Uh, we're called Finarte, pronounced in a Finnish way. <laughs> so uh, we are actually a 30-year-old company that was founded by my parents in 1985. And my mother is a textile designer and that's sort of where the name came from because we're from Finland and it is art in a way, although it is a commercial product, it's still art. Everything is hand woven, each piece is different. Awesome. So, um, out of all of the different pieces that you have here, yeah. I get, I'm going to put you on a spot just a little bit here. Which would be your favourite? Just one. That's a really tricky one. Yeah. <laughs> it's a really tricky one. Um, um, well, I would have to say that I'm really excited about our latest product, which is uh, the new uh, throws, which are made of recycled cotton and they're hand printed on top and we also have a matching cushion with every everyone so it's really i'm really excited about these and of course they really nicely complement the rugs and everything it's a really good awesome. so as a company yeah. um is is sustainability and recycled materials is it becoming more, more important to your brand and other brands around the world do you feel like that is something that we should be reaching towards to make things more ethical well i definitely think it is something that not only well i think it's actually consumer driven people are really interested in how products are made whether they're sustainable if they're made in a responsible manner and for us it's uh, this is not like a fashion thing that is in right now because we've been making these rugs from uh, upcycled and recycled materials right from the beginning because that is the history kind of where we are growing out growing from is the Finnish ragwork tradition where we used to the grandmothers and mothers used to weave in their homes uh, from old bed sheets and everything make these beautiful rugs so now we're making it to the next level by producing our rugs from upcycled materials as well but this one comes from the really massive industry of textiles Awesome. Thank you so much for just having a chat with me. It's been lovely. Thank you. Um, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> um, make sure you guys go and check out Fanati. I will put all of the links down below, as always. Um, so you can go check it out and go and see more beautiful things because everything that I've shown you today is 100% brilliant and beauty. So make sure you go and check it out. Hi, guys. I have been reunited with some of my favourite people in the world, which is, it's always a good time when you get reunited with your favourite people. Um, so, just going to have a quick chat with them, and yeah, yeah we're just going to get straight in. Hello. Hello. Um, so, firstly, how are you? Are you good? Are you feeling good? Of course, I'm always good. Good. <laughs> um, so, what is... Firstly, the name of your brand and what is your brand? What do you do? Our brand name is Rigid and it means fine art. And the name comes from Thai language. And fine art is a description for us how we are doing. We don't have any boundaries when we are designing. Okay, awesome. Um, so, out of the beautiful collection behind you, which piece? Would you say is best for like runways or going to events? Which would you 
you like you love to see what do you love to see on people at the collection? Uh, actually I have many pieces what I love to see uh, for example our Austrian skirts and Austrian uh, dresses and also we have nice uh, leather pieces now coming next autumn winter. Maybe these are now the most favorable for me. So, so um, we're gonna move over to the lovely Tiffany and just check out her outfit that was lovingly made by you. Um, so we will um, check it out. So where, what is like the name of this dress? Why was it designed? This is now from our this spring and summer collection and the name of this collection is Flowers of David. Oh. And the David name comes from the men's collection where we are using the David statues. And the flowers describe the flowers that we are using all these ladies uh, pieces. So as you can see, Tiffany looks amazing in this dress. How do you feel it? Oh, I love it. Awesome. I love it. And it is. I love all of Ollie's work, but this this particular piece, I just I feel wonderful in it. So okay. yeah, very privileged to wear it. Awesome. And can we take a look at the back? Of course. So guys, the back is genuinely amazing. So look how beautiful it is. It looks amazing. So yes. <laughs> but yes, thank you so much thank for chatting you. with me. And also, thank you so much for inviting me today because I've had the best time. You are very welcome. Thank you. Hi guys, I am with the fabulous Emma. Hi! <laughs> um, so we're just going to jump straight into this interview and talk about the product, lovely products that she has on the table. What is the name of your brand? So here we have Valilla. Finnish people would say Valilla, but here in England probably people say Valila. <laughs> so, you know, either works. <laughs> Um, and what do you do? Like, I, I, I know what you do, but they don't know what you do. Okay, so uh, Valila is uh, over 80, 80, 80 years old uh, textile company. So we have a very long history in textiles. Um, Valila was established in 1935. And um, we basically, we do a very wide range of lifestyle products. So here we have um, curtains and fabrics, which most of our designs come as. Uh, then rugs, rugs is one of our other key category. We have a lot of different qualities, materials, and uh, designs. And uh, then we have a lot of small accessories. So we have cushions. Um, we have tableware, which is new for this spring. Um, we have kitchen textiles. We have trays. Um, and then for the bathroom, um, we've got towels, shower curtains, bath mats. Then we also do wallpaper. Awesome. So you you pretty much kind of covered. Yeah, so we've covered the house. Cool. That's cool. And um, so, other than covering the house, obviously, yeah. um, where would you like to go in like the next five years with this brand? Well, other than conquering the world, <laughs> um, we basically Finland is currently our biggest market. So now we are looking to expand also and our UK market. So hopefully you will find us from most of the high street retailers soon. Um, we sell online, so we've just, um, six months ago we launched our new online store, www.valilla.co.uk. So that you will can be order put down there. Pounds yep. <laughs> and um, ship it straight to your door, which is good. Um, but yeah, we do a lot of online business. And um, then obviously we have some independent retailers um, all across England. Awesome. I really, okay, out of all of them, I know which I personally would pick as my favourite, but which kind of piece that's on this table on display, which would you pick as like your favourite piece? My favourite, well, one of my favourites is, um, because Valilla basically, you can categorise our designs roughly into four categories. So we have the nature designs, this is one of my favourite, this is Luanda Polka, which means nature path. Um, so we take our designers, we have five in-house designers, so they draw a lot of inspirations from the Finnish nature, Scandinavian, Nordic nature. Um, then we have our urban designs, so this is Oulu, which is actually um, sort of my hometown, so um, I like that. And um, then we have floral and graphic designs. But then one which is um, 
really fun one as well came from the city designs. We did a collaboration with Transport for London, so they wanted us to design a London design for them. So this was launched um, last September at Design Factory in King's Cross. That's very cool. That's very, very cool. So I know that there would be a lot of people watching this that would really love like the bags, the tote bags and stuff, yeah. which would be really really cool, especially for people who are in London. Yeah. It would be really really cool and definitely extremely fashionable. Well you can still get the London product specifically from the London um, Transport Museum shop in Covent Garden, so go and get yours from there and otherwise you can just log into our web store. Awesome. So thank you very very much thank for you. this interview and all of the links that have been mentioned will be down in the description below and copy on the screen right now so make sure you guys go check them out thank you so so much and we can also give you a sneaky um, special discount code for our online store as well oh guys yes <laughs> thank you very much so I'm here with more lovely people like oh, this whole event it's has just been <laughs> This whole event has been so lovely and I've met so many lovely, lovely people. So we're just going to get into this chat, it's going to be great and yeah, let's get into it. Okay. Yes. So we've just introduced... Um, I wanted to introduce... Yes, yeah, yeah introduce that. Yes, yes. So I wanted to introduce our managing director and designer of the company and uh, she's been in this uh, pieces over... Uh, 30, 40 years, but the company Rosa Fox has been founded in uh, 1992 already. And uh, actually, at the beginning, she was struggling with the problem of size of the product. Then, then she, she discovered that, okay, I will, let's make it simple. <laughs> <laughs> we created a very nice triangle shaped uh, shawl, which is one size, so we everyone can wear it. <laughs> And um, so the design is always very classical and timeless. Yeah. So the product is quite sustainable too because you can wear it for, for a long time, always. Actually. <laughs> <laughs> it's I guess lovely. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, yeah. this is in short uh, our company's Thank you. Uh, and so history. Where do you see your company, Rosa Fox, going in the next five years or so? So actually, uh, the company trademark has been registered over, over the, in uh, over 20 countries already. Awesome. So uh, and of uh, turnover, uh, approximately 80% comes from exportation. So um, this is something that um, we will expand our business to Asian markets. And Russia has been always very, very for market for our products so <coughs> uh, but uh, nowadays the online sales are coming uh, very very uh, hard so that's something we have to adapt ourselves uh, to that too but uh, first of all we have solved the problem of size already <laughs> so the margin is very good for this product this kind of product yeah. <laughs> and um, that's what, something we will go on. What is this made of? What is this? It's made of the uh, finished blue box, which is uh, of uh, very good quality, meaning that um, they are working very hard now in the, in the first sector in Finland, and they they have uh, certification, e, e, uh, ISO certification already. Yeah. So um, the welfare of animals is very important too. So the quality comes from. Uh, awesome. Thank you so much for having this lovely chat with me and for just showing your designs are amazing and just I love I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Could you just introduce yourself and the company? Bruno Bogron, that's my name. Lumi is the most interesting part of it. We do leather under all its forms, leather clay from handbags, leather goods, gloves, shoes, and now the scent, scent of the snow. So we do both leather and scent. Awesome. So, um, 
where are you looking to expand to over the next couple of years? Mostly in Asia, uh, considering the market of Japan and Korea. That's mostly where we are strong at and we're pushing it. Cool. And where can people find you online? In London, the Conrad Shops, Candium, uh, Vesu Nassos and the uh, different boutiques here and there. Awesome. <laughs> cool, thank you very, very Lovely. much. Lovely, thank you.